In number one, we are given two sets of parallel lines, and it says that the measure of angle two is 102 degrees. So that means if this line is parallel to this line, it's cut by this transversal, the angle one and angle two are supplementary, is same side interior supplementary, so this would be 78 degrees. In number three, because these two lines are parallel, cut by this transversal, we have another pair of same side interior, so this would also be 78 degrees. And then lastly, looking at these two parallel lines, cut by this transversal, same side interior would be supplementary, so this is 102 degrees. The quadrilateral within this figure you can check the interangle sum is 360, but because both pair of opposite sides are parallel, this is a parallelogram. So when I do the notes, I'll refer back to question number one. In number two, it said you had quadrilateral ABCD, given the angle measures, so you're given all four, one, two, three, four angle measures, we know that the interangle sum for a four-sided figure is 360 degrees, so 80, plus 2x plus x plus 4x is equal to 180 degrees. Combining like terms, we've got 7x equals, subtract the 80 um, from that side, and this should actually be a sum of 360 degrees for quadrilateral. Now when I subtract the 80, it's 280 degrees, divide by 7, and x is 40. In number three, part A wants us to find the midpoint of the segment that joins the two endpoints and then find the length. So I'm first going to connect part A and B. I'm going to write down the two formulas. Midpoint formula is the average of the x's and y's. Distance is x2 minus x1 squared plus y2 minus y1 squared. So substituting in using these two points as my x1, y1, x2, y2. I want to average the x's. We've got negative 5 plus 3 over 2 and then 6 plus 2 over 2. So we end up with negative 2 over 2 and 8 over 2, which is negative 1, 4. Distance, or length, x2 minus x1, um, 3 minus a negative 5 squared, plus 2 minus 6 squared, gives me a positive 8 squared, plus negative 4 squared. And 64 plus 16 is the square root of 80. But in simplest radical form, the largest perfect square factor of 80 is 16, and it's 16 times 5, so my length or distance would be 4 radical 5. 